Zack, 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 Zack. Here we are with Zack the Science Guy and his evil henchman. Ha ha ha! I've finally been able to settle my dispute with my neighbor. See, we've been having a argument, as one might say. <laughs> Over which is worse, a hurricane or a tornado? I say it's a hurricane, he says it's a tornado. Well, I finally made a machine which can create both with the single push of a button. Since he's so stubborn, I'm having the brawl in his yard. How would that work? How will it work? <laughs> How will it work? Don't be stupid. It's just gonna work. Okay, well, I'll explain how it works. The hurricane... It creates, in order to make the hurricane, we need warm, moist air over low pressures, tropical wind <coughs> currents, sort of ish. Yeah, that's it. And then with a tornado, you simply need a cold, dry air mass with a warm, moist air mass and have them collide together. I just make, need to make a few changes, though. And, uh, that's it. <coughs> There it goes. Better than you. No, -uh, I'm better. Oh yeah, I can produce winds over 170 miles an hour. That's nothing. I can produce winds over 300 miles per hour and produce over a billion dollars in damage. Well, that's nothing. I can cause over 80 billion dollars in damage, you little dust devil. Would you call me Truffle Depression? <laughs> you heard me, you Gus Nato. Nine one one, what's your emergency? Help! I created a tornado and a hurricane, and my henchman's a dog now, and they've moved towards the school. You do realize that it's a two million dollar fine for prank calling nine one one, right? Ah, I'm fizzling out. Ha! I can last for days. Okay, so there was a tornado and a hurricane, and they damaged stuff and caused a bunch of money and whatnot and junk. So yeah. But we are all reminded of the past tornadoes and hurricanes, like the Utah Kansas tornado and the hurricanes like Katrina and Andrew. Out!